you. Front of the distribution center. <laughs> Let me tell you about it. It's a little place where we distribute things. Yeah, we're gonna go. Kids. Love on kids, man. All day. All the time. Good to see the kids that we saw last time. Sure, like, Show them our face again. So they're like, hey, I know you. Yeah. <laughs> last time I didn't, I was like reserved last time for some reason. I think I was in my head. Maybe because I've oh. done service oh, oh, oh. projects before and it was different than I expected. So this time I'm gonna get out of my box and just squish them all. They're gonna prepare breakfast in here for the kids that Two days. We're here on Saturday and on Monday. Monday morning at 7, we're going to serve 180 hot breakfasts. And then in the afternoon, we'll be serving 80 some lunches to the kids in the morning and afternoon sessions. So, two days from now, we'll be feeding the kids. We are headed to paint um, a, a school. We're headed back to the house that we were at yesterday. We're electricians! Woo! An awesome single mom and her kids. Yesterday we did the outside of the house. Okay. Uh, we put a paper and then chicken wire so they can do stuff for later. Oh, nice. Perfect measurement, Loretta and Larry. Say that. What? Um, what we've been doing, Danny and I, we've been drilling holes through. And as you can see, we ran a, uh, a hot line so they could put a water heater eventually uh, back here. This is the family of a single mom yeah. that was abused and so forth through her life. Yeah. Uh, so we got three teenagers that actually live here. Okay. And then um, we're actually here to uh, support them, just get them a little bit place to, uh, to live and so forth. Okay. <laughs> I just love these kids. I want to steal every single one of them and just give them all my love. <laughs> every last bit of it. <laughs> Even if we can't solve world hunger and homelessness and all of these things, that we can just be a moment of breath of fresh air. And that's what God is, I think, for us, is that sometimes that breath of fresh air, we need to just be like, Ooh. okay, great. Never in my wildest dreams would I think I'd be on a mission trip. <laughs> with my church and then laying with my wife on the beach, you know, I am good enough and I'm worthy to have my wife and a great community and like we can just be us, you know. I think for me in this community, in this weekend and in the, in the previous trip as well, um, what I've recognized is that I belong like for the first time. So thank you for helping me in that, it's showing me love and belonging and acceptance. I literally could not have asked for a, a more incredible group of humans to call my family.